Hello everybody, it's Cree Rama, and I am starting a new um, altered book. And I just want to show you, I just picked this up at my used bookstore. So what I did, let's see if you can, yeah. So if you see on the spine here, I saved the pages that are, you know, kind of connected to the covers so that I can make it look a little cleaner when I put my pages back in here. And here's the back. So I removed the center pages and this book, this book was great because, let's see, okay. So you see here, I can't, these are already removed. I can kind of come in and just pull the individual signatures apart. So once I find it, I just go and sort of push down on the crease here and just sort of work it and it will separate. Um, I might have to cut once I get more into the center, but make sure I don't rip it. Yeah, I might have to cut this glue off. But my idea, I'm going to cover, glue some of the pages together, cover it with gesso, and then put it back in the book to do my altered book. So that's what I wanted to jump on and show today. So I'm going to work on that and I'll be back with some more fun stuff. Okay, so here I have my each individual signature and what I'm doing is just removing some of the center pages of the signature so that it'll leave me with either three or four pages on uh, both sides. So I decided that I'm going to go around, I'm going to sew the pages, put it through my sewing machine. So I'm just going to use a glue stick just to kind of hold the pages together and in place. If you don't want to do sewing, that's fine. You, you'll just want to use a, um, a better glue or permanent glue stick. And then once I glue um, both sides of the signature and get the pages all glued down, I'm going to go in with a credit card or something to kind of flatten them down and make sure there aren't any creases in the pages. So here you can see I went around my signatures and I sewed the pages. And so each signature will just have two pages. And then I'm taking each one and I am putting them together using the, the tab binding technique. And if you don't know how to do that, I, I do have a video on that process. It's very easy. And now I'm just going to go in and in between the signatures, I'm just going to put a little bit of that uh, linen tape just to kind of support it a little bit more. So that's what I'm doing here. And then I'm gonna cover each page with some gesso so um, it doesn't matter really what it looks like. It's gonna be all covered up. So here I'm just showing you I have um, all the pages put together. I went around the, the entire thing with some more tape and showing you the pages and how it's put together here. Okay, so I have um, I went ahead and took the pages and I sewed them right back into the spine of the book. And now I'm just covering the pages with some gesso. Okay, everybody, I'm back and I got two books that are finished. Well, finished as far as put together and ready to start decorating. Um, I will show you the altered book first. So I got all the pages put in and instead of doing, you know, just the underpants, um, as Lori, Lori Marie Jenkins calls it underpants, putting down the, um, you know, a base layer, I just put down these circus pages, printables. 
so I've got the over it's just ready to start decorating some of these I'll probably put some gesso over top but that's okay just have a little bit of a base here and everything the pages are still very damp so we have some dry time so there we go and this is the altered book so <coughs> excuse me what I did was <laughs> my hands but I took um, the extra pages that I had from here and I made another book so I have this boho kind of cover that I've had done and I just sort of did a, a patchwork thing with all these little pieces so I'll show you what I did here make sure I'm in here so I put a little folder here little pocket and then these two flip open and I think I'm gonna do some ATC cards to go in these pockets and then this, are, this is the uh, altar book pages here. So I did the same thing, but this one I kind of put a couple little flips in. You can see this flips out. And I, oh, this one I just sort of put in the middle. This is the middle of the signature. I put another with pockets. And then here we have another flip, and then this is the end. So that's what I have. So I'm really excited. I have these put together, and I'm ready to start creating in them and decorating. So thank you. And if you try this technique with um, altered books, or if you like making altered books and you have a different technique or style or something, please share and um, like the video, leave me a comment, and thank you so much for watching.